It will only take you a few minutes to set up your Sense8. Let's make sure these conditions are met before getting started. Make sure you have a 2.4 GHz Wi-Fi. If your router provides dual-band Wi-Fi networks, please make sure 5G Wi-Fi does not share the same SSID or Wi-Fi name with the 2.4G Wi-Fi, so you can easily select the right one. If you have any questions about 2.4G or 5G, you can consult your router provider for suggestions. Also make sure you have the correct Wi-Fi password. Remember to position your Sense 8 close to the router. Get ready! Let's move on to set up the process. First, download the Sense8 app from the App Store or Google Play. Just search for Sense8 and select the app with the green S icon. Download the app and open it. If this is the first time you open the Sense8 app, select Sign Up and create an account. If you already have an account, just log in. After signing up, the in-app prompts will remind you to add a Sense8 device. If you miss the prompt or directly log in, you can tap the Me icon at the bottom of the app and then tap Add Sense8. Select Add Sense8 as an owner. Entering the new screen, you can follow the instructions step-by-step -step to set your device up. Now power your Sense8. The charge port is at the bottom of the device and then plug in the AC adapter. Then keep pushing the power button for a few seconds to turn on the Sense8. Release the power button when you can see the indicator light is on. The light will turn from white to blinking yellow in a few seconds, which means it's ready to get connected. Enter the Wi-Fi Connect screen. You'll find a default SSID or Wi-Fi name already listed. If you prefer to use another Wi-Fi network, there's a slight difference between iOS and Android device. For an iOS user, you need to tap the green phrase Tap Here button under the SSID. Enter the settings to change the Wi-Fi and then return to the Sense8 app. For an Android user, you can tap the SSID and select a Wi-Fi from the pop-out list. Just remember to select a 2.4G Wi-Fi. Then enter the correct Wi-Fi password and tap Next. An incorrect password will lead to failure of the setup, so please double check. Now turn the media volume to maximum on your smartphone and position your phone closer to the front side of your Sense8. Tap Next to continue when you complete the instructions. At this screen, you'll hear your smartphone making a sound like this. Wait until it automatically enters the next screen. Watch the indicator light of the device. Wait and see if it turns from blinking blue to solid blue. If so, it means your Sense8 is connected to your Wi-Fi. Tap the green button and let your smartphone pair with the device. The pairing usually takes one to two minutes. Please be patient as it might be dependent on the signal strength. When you see the screen turn like this, congratulations, your Sense8's been successfully set up. If you come up with any questions during the setup, for example, have error messages, the light does not change as expected, or the app tells you that the setup fails, we suggest resetting the device to go through the setup process all over again. To reset your Sense8, you need a pin to press the reset button at the bottom of the device. It's a little pin hole near the charge port. And when you press it with a pin, you can hear a click to make sure it's pressed. Keep pressing for several seconds until the light turns white and then release. It will turn yellow blinking soon, meaning it's ready to be set up again.